The Natura Moldable Skin Barrier provides a custom fit and is gentle on the skin, secure and easy to use. To apply, start by removing the barrier from its package, but do not remove the clear release liner or release paper. Press your thumbs or fingers at the center of the starter hole and begin to roll and mold the hole to the size of your stoma. Do not stretch, pull, or cut the adhesive to make it bigger. Once you have rolled the opening to the best fit for your stoma, gently press down on the rolled portion to hold its shape. Find the tab and remove the clear release liner from the back of the skin barrier. Immediately center the opening over your stoma and press the skin barrier into place. Push the molded roll of adhesive towards your stoma. The moldable part will rebound and turtleneck around your stoma, ensuring a close fit. Remove the release paper from the fabric collar and press against your skin, smoothing out any wrinkles. Before applying the pouch, separate the sides of the pouch to allow some air to enter. Align the plastic ring, also known as the flange, on the pouch with the flange of the skin barrier. Press the two flanges together beginning at the bottom, working your way up to the top. Several clicks may be heard. Double check that the flanges are snapped securely together by pressing all the way around them a second time. Press and hold your hands in place for at least 30 seconds to ensure good adhesion. To remove the system, clean the surrounding skin with an adhesive remover wipe or spray. In this demonstration, we are using a wipe. Lift a corner of the skin barrier or tape, wipe the adhesive remover between the skin, and then gently peel the adhesive down and away while continuing to wipe. With the other hand, push down on the skin above the barrier to aid removal. Wash the skin thoroughly with water and pat dry. To prepare for applying a new pouching system, use a protective barrier wipe or spray to create a protective film on the skin. Simply spray or pat a barrier wipe around the area and let it dry thoroughly.